the itinerant mage here, Stefan Hoffman. I am very excited to announce that this is the first of a couple of um, a new series of interviews that I'm going to be doing. I think you're going to be quite excited about it. So for those of you who don't know, I am one third of the Wellness Lifestyle Conference. And what we've decided to do is actually start doing a few interviews with various um, of our speakers, just so you can get to know a bit about them and a bit about us. So for those of you who don't know, as I said, I am Stefan Hoffman, the itinerant mage, who is a integrative prosperity and life coach. And today we're going to be introducing Fiona van Rensburg. So I am going to add her to this chat now. Ah, perfect. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Right. So we're so excited to have you with us today. Thank you so much for joining us. This is Thank just going to be, like I said, a nice little interview where you get to tell your clients and our, ours as well a little bit about yourself so they can find out who is the person behind the portal of alchemy. So, without further ado, shall we jump right in? And why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself and a bit about your background? Okay, thank you. Yes, I just want to thank the um, group for this opportunity uh, and all that you do. Uh, I love participating in it and um, uh, lots of gratitude. If you see flashes oh, here, it's, uh, we've got lightning, <laughs> rain and lightning going ah. on at the moment. So, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so just about myself. Yes, um, my name is Fiona van Rensburg. Uh, I've been the owner of the Portal of Alchemy since its inception in uh, June 2010. So it's uh, been going now for 10 years, full time. Wow. Uh, as a basis, I'm an alchemist, I'm a star seed, and I am a way shower. Um, so to be an alchemist is transforming those uh, energies into higher dimensional frequencies. Uh, the bringers uh -huh. of the new dawn, new, uh, the new, transmuting the old paradigms into higher levels of awareness. So I work, and my work spans across many dimensions uh, and many uh, realities. Uh, I open the portal and connect people. So that is uh, what I do. Um, as a star seed, my galaxy of origin has been Pleiades, Orion, Lyra, the Milky Way galaxy, and then also Neptune. So I work with various star beings from those uh, dimensions and from those uh -huh. galaxies in my healing sessions. I also work with the various Magi, Merlin, Archangel Raziel that works with alchemy. I work with Archangel Michael with Jesus, with Buddha. So there's various ascended masters uh, that works with me and I, it, I'm guided in my work. I'm always guided by spirit. Uh, it's never, it's like before a session starts, I connect with my higher self and all my, uh, my team. And then I connect with the client's higher self and their team. And I'm guided in what I need to do for them to shift. So as a way show, I, and part of the shining ones, and we anchor the key code rays, part of the divine rays. Our aim is just to shine light so that others can see. It's uh, just showing the way. Uh -huh. I, am, I don't tell people what to do. I just open the path, take them on a journey, and connect them with themselves, with their true authentic selves. So where people go through awakening, I can help them because they usually – after awakening, they don't see the life the same as they've seen it uh, prior. Uh -huh. um, they, so I help them along the ascension path, help them to empower themselves, ha help them to be okay with their authentic self, I help them with uh, their personal growth, uh, with uh, spiritual development. I'm an empath, in, an emotional healer. I work on intuition. If it's a body issue, if it's a mind issue, if it's an emotional issue, if it's a... Uh, Spiritual issue, I I can help them transmute that uh, tron, uh, and totally transform their lives. I'm also a mother of two adult children, and uh, that is a bit about me. With my background, 
Um, I've, I've had my own awakening in 2001 after I got a divorce. So usually it takes mm -hmm. some event in your life that um, uh, wakes you up and shakes you up and you start searching for answers and uh, looking at life differently. I went on every breakthrough experience that I could, was spiritually hungry, read every spiritual book that I could lay my hands on. And then in 2007, I became a Reiki master. I also did the, the Pleiadian and uh, Melchizedek teachings where um, I got to my um, uh, certificate in uh, crystal life body activations. Then I did a course on uh, uh, connecting with the archangels and doing attunements with them in 2013. I did the DNA um, reprogramming of the chakras in 2017. In 2011, I did Applied Energy he uh, Healer Certification course. 2017, I uh, was involved with Metavarsity, did the introduction to metaphysics, became a facilitator, did the facilitator course. X passed away in 2007, after which I then moved down to Durban. And by 2010, I decided no, I have found my life path. I now know what my life purpose is and I started doing that full time and I've never looked back. So I followed the low road less traveled um, and uh, have lived uh, through and healed uh, my own traumas, my own experiences of abuse, uh, divorce, death of a spouse, uh, heartaches, pains, grief, sadness, sorrow, and learned how to holistically heal all aspects of mm -hmm. ourselves physical selves, emotional selves, mental selves, and our soul selves, and bringing everyone together, removing those layers or those false layers to get to your authentic self and authentically be my quirky self, uh, which is different, and I'm okay with my difference. I didn't come here to be anyone else. And hello to those that have been joining and saying hello. Thank you. Hi, Margo. <laughs> <laughs> So um, th th that is a br brief background of uh, me. I, my work is very much guided by my own life experiences. I walk my talk. Uh -huh. it, it's, it's, I've been through it. So for clients, it's in front of me, been there, done that, got that T-shirt, and then uh, um, help them through my own experiences. Fantastic. So that actually leads me straight into my next question. But before I go there, um, to those who are, are watching us live now, if you have any questions, please feel free to share it in the chat um, and we'll answer that as we go along. But Fiona, my question to you is, do you feel like all of that pain and trauma that you went through really pushed you to create this platform that you work with um, and that you use to help your, your clients? Yes, I, in hindsight, I can see the perfection in it all. Because uh, it's, if, if you haven't been there, you can read as many books as uh, you want. Uh, book mm -hmm. knowledge can pick up you a certain, uh, to a certain degree. But if you physically live through those experiences, it definitely gives you more in-depth insight on that. It's like I experience emotions uh, in a broad band, not just um, superficially, not just... Uh, uh, in a light way. So it, uh, as uh, one, as I get to experience it, I can relate it to others and I can relate to their feelings and I can then help them. So definitely um, it's a tool that I can go back to in their own experiences. Oh, fantastic. Now that is excellent. Now tell us what some... Uh, so Margot says she feels like she can relate right now compared to two years ago. Um, yes. That is, I think so many of us can, you know, when you look back, or rather I should say, when you're going through something traumatic, you don't always see the divine plan in action. It's only when you yeah. look back that you can see how perfect it was in terms of what it brought you for your growth. So, yeah, I'm so happy that more and more people like yourself are really doing what they can to use those events to help uplift and to heal those around them. 
But Fiona, what would you say are your big future plans for Bobo Dalton? What where do you see your reach going? What 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 would you like to achieve with this over the next 5, 10, 15, 100 years or so? <laughs> okay, thank you for that question. Well, currently uh, my service offerings are, are my um uh my own personal alchemy sessions or where I help people transform, transmute um I also do the chakra balancing, so uh, light body activations, DNA activations, past life regressions, uh, understanding and clearing all those uh, experiences and uh, limitations and vows that we've made. Also helping people w- connect with their soul purpose, activating that so that they can live their own authentic path um in uh, fulfilling their soul purpose. But I first had to find my own to be able to guide somebody to this um mm-hmm. uh, i do a lot of journey work uh, uh, transformational life coaching uh spiritual counseling my courses uh, i do enneagram courses a uh, four in one practitioner course high priest with the training helping people connect to the higher aspects of themselves the return to original innocence where they connect with uh, um the 12 aspects uh, the 12 master selves mm-hmm. uh, and becoming more fully themselves also archangel attunements and as going forward i'm guided to also do uh, or start collaborating with people on life mastery online retreats where guiding people and helping people assisting people through various techniques of various um uh, life workers to stand in their authenticity to make those shifts to get the courage uh, to become more empowered within themselves uh, so that they can grow and develop uh, you know the aspects uh, that uh, they need mm. to so to help them through that change so busy working on that also busy working on various teaching and healing various aspects of relationships and the 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 challenges that comes with it and uh, all that and also uh, since the lockdown one thing that i realized that, that was lacking in my own life was somebody to be able to talk to um uh, relate to having a sounding board or someone to hold space or just uh, to be into or whatever and i am busy setting that up where i'll make half an hour slots available to people where it's on a retainer basis and you book a few in, uh, during the month and you've got somebody to talk to because i find uh, that um as soon as people start awakening they just need to quickly touch base or just need to release or ne- just need to debrief or just need to get things off their chest because as we block ourselves up okay, it takes us just a lot more to clear and to open up so i'm working on mm-hmm. that so uh, ultimately it's also to help others help others so it's first to help themselves uh, and then to help others because it's far more reaching to i just like i don't i don't have to heal or a, a million people or anything like that it's for me it is the next person that i see because they have influence over their circle of friends and their influences mm-hmm. and my aim is i'm going to say my ultimate aim is to help as many people as i can reach their their highest and greatest human potential whatever they came here to do to encourage to inspire to uplift and uh, to create that support for them because it can be a lonely journey if you don't follow the rules that other people do and don't just do the norm and and you take the road less traveled um it takes a lot of guts and if you don't have that support system in place um you tend to fall back and uh, rather go back to what you know and uh, um and it's to create that safety and to uh, provide that security so i i i i'm always guided by spirit in what's the next step i, I don't have a 10 year plan i don't have a 15 year or 50 year plan i just know i'm here to do my work and as i transform and transmute stuff within myself because spirit keeps it real <laughs> i 
I'm not oh, overseeing yeah. that because <laughs> my own lessons and my own um, experiences. So, um, but as I personally develop, I'm able to help more. So it's a, for me, it's a lifelong mm-hmm. learning. I remain a student, yet I teach. So I find that we can all learn from one another and grow together and develop together. So my offerings, I have some that's for free and my YouTube channel that I put a lot of information out there, bringing through metaphysical principles and teachings in an easily understandable way and giving people tools to be able to use. Then I... Uh, so then I have my one-on-one sessions. I've got online sessions. I've got courses. So I try to cater for everyone. Uh, if they just want to dip their toe in, uh, then they can just uh, listen to one of the YouTube ones. But where they actually right. want to go and delve deep within themselves, I find uh, that mm-hmm. the journeys that I've wor- walked with people have been phenomenal. The shift and uh, the transformation in their lives, it's at most life-changing. That is incredible. And I couldn't agree with you more when you said, you know, instead of having this huge, massive goal of, oh, I'm going to impact 10 million people, to mm-hmm. just impact one person at a time makes yes. all the difference. You know, if you want to change the world, start with yourself. And it's yes. true. Eventually, things does just create a beautiful ripple effect. And I think yeah. that that is so amazing, the work that you're doing and the fact that you're also providing various levels of interaction and information because there are a lot of people out there who have this knowing that something is not quite right, but they're not quite ready to, you know, go on this full healing journey and and just delve right in. So that is incredible. So we really do thank you for that as well. Now, in terms of people, our, our pleasure. In terms of people wanting to get in touch with you, how do they go about doing that? Okay, so um, the Portal of Alchemy is sort of on every <laughs> social media platform that there is. Um, I, um, I've got a website. Uh, it's uh, at mm-hmm. www.portalofalchemy.com. And um, there's uh, various offerings and uh, the various uh, services, uh, products, courses uh, that I offer. I um, have got my YouTube channel. It's uh, the, uh, the Portal of Alchemy YouTube channel where I put all the information, what you can expect from the various sessions that I offer, some must-watch uh, videos. I've got the one on the, one of the must-watch videos. The source of all that is is a one that has been watched the most. Um, uh, it's a, the latest epiphany and realizations uh, that I um, gained from recent experiences. And I, I, I like to share the information. So there's, a, mm-hmm. there's a, my satsangs are on there, guided meditations on there, a whole lot. Um, I'm available on email at info at portalofalchemy.com. I'm available on WhatsApp. I do sessions via Zoom or Skype or WhatsApp video chat or in-person in Kluv in uh, KZN. So there's 101 ways that people can get in touch with me. I'm on LinkedIn. I'm on Instagram. uh, I'm on Pinterest. uh, So I I try because I find then certain people are just on LinkedIn. So I I make myself available there. Certain people are just on Facebook and I make myself available all day. So I'm cancel those and are just on Instagram. So I make sure that it doesn't matter where they are, they can find me. If they look up Fiona, Portal of Alchemy, they will definitely find me. (laughs) Excellent. So on that note, just to um, those listening now and also for the replays, um, we will be sharing this video across all our social media channels. So it will be on YouTube. It's going to be on LinkedIn. It's going to be on all our various personal Instagrams as well. So you'll be able to catch this replay. I will make sure that in the captions, I include links through to Fiona as well. Um, But lastly, I wanted to just leave everybody with a short message. Um, For those of you who don't know, 
Fiona is a regular live speaker on the Wellness Lifestyle Conference, which is the conference that we have set up in, in conjunction with Tracy and Priscilla. Um, the link to that conference is in my profile. You'll be able to just click through the link and you'll be able to go through to that. And on that conference, um, Fiona is kind enough to share some incredible, really premium content with us, which we are so grateful and so blessed to be able to have and to share with, with the world as well. And Fiona, we look forward to having you on our next one as well. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, it's, it's, it gives me great joy to share with, uh, with others. So thank you for creating the platform. Much appreciated. It's, we love the fact that we're getting to share your beautiful talents, not just yours, but all the speakers' beautiful talents with the world. Okay. So that is really great. Fiona, thank you for your time this evening. Um, to those, Bye. thank you so much. And we'll speak soon. Bye. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Bye. Yes. Bye.